Hey everyone, this is Josh Galvin with Tizish.com. So on this video tutorial, I want to show you how you can put a video into your a custom landing tab on your Facebook page. All right, so here's the Tizish Facebook page, and I've already done a test video just to show you what I mean. So here's a tab called Test Video, and um. I'm using this same logo picture here as an example just to show you on this video how you could do this but let's say this is something uh, some kind of marketing message of, of a video or something right that when someone clicks on it check out what happens it start it'll play your YouTube video hey everyone this is John so Gal I'm gonna show you how to do this but here's what you need to have prepared for this obviously you need to have a video prepared and number two have an image that you want to be the, the clickable image it could be anything it could be a picture of a play button. It could be a picture of you guys that says play, listen now or anything. So you need to have those ready, okay? Now, I'm going to go ahead and start this all over again just to show you from scratch, all right? So here's what you need to do. First and foremost, you need to make sure you have the static FBML app hooked up to your site. If you don't know how to do that, then check out my other video tutorial. I'll include with this one as part of a link showing you how to get this on your site and how to create custom tabs like this. But the whole idea is you have to use this tool called Static FBML. After you have this tool, here's what you're gonna do. All right. After you have this tool, you're gonna be. You need to go here. Go to your page. Click on Edit Page. Go to Applications. And under Applications, you're gonna go to. You'll see one called FBML. All right. And uh, again, follow my first tutorial on creating a custom landing page to see this. But the point is, after you have an FBML app here's what you need to do you need to click on go to application all right and I'm gonna delete this code that's currently here just to show you everything so this code that, that you see there is what um, what create the video so this code is what you need to do you need to copy and paste this code that I give you it's gonna be along with this video you need to copy and paste it into here all right and now there's two things we need to do number one we need to get the video ID of the video that we want to have on our home page that's the first thing number two we need to get an image as you see here on this part of the code an image that we want to be the clickable playable image like I showed you in the beginning so let's do the first one let's get an image all right here's the easiest way you can do it go to your tizish or I'm sorry go to your to your fan page home page whatever you want to call that so here it is and uh, click on your photos all right now what you could do is either upload a whole new photo or just use your home page photo anything the whole point is let's pretend you upload a photo well click on your photo and keep clicking on it until you you're completely on this one image when you're on this one image here's what you need to do you know right click and put copy image URL or whatever it is on your wait I'm using Chrome if what kind of browser just right click and it's gonna allow you to copy some kind of image URL after that here's what you need to do paste that image URL into the top of your page and you'll see a big long code that ends in jpg or something dot png something so when you click enter you're gonna have your whole image here which lets you know it's the right code so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this image URL I'm gonna go back to my code that I'm showing you and see this part here image sort um, image img src equals what you need to do is take take this put an image URL here and notice how I don't touch the quotes, right? I don't touch the quotations. But basically, take that and just paste that big image code that I had that I had just taken from the from the uh, the URL of Facebook up here. All right. So that's the first thing. What that did right there is put that first blank image I showed you in the beginning. Now the second thing we need to do is add the video code here. All right. The video ID. So here's how you find that. Go to YouTube. Here's the video I'm doing here as a test. So, here on YouTube, one moment, what you need to do is the following. See where it says watch, question mark, the URL at the top? Find the video that you want, and basically what you need to do is find this. Click on your video, and then after where it says watch, question mark, V equals, whatever V equals, that's your video ID. Okay, so you right click, you click on copy, now we go back to our code section. Here's our code section, and then replace all the X's. Don't touch the question mark, but just replace all the X's with that ID. After that, you're all set. What we just did now is we put an intro picture, and we put an ID to identify what video we want for this 
for this um, welcome tab. All right. So let's just now look at it in action. Here's our tab. Here's our test video. And when I go to it, see here, he see here it is right here. When I click on play, or when I just click on it, it's gonna start playing. Hey, ever. All right. So that's how you make that work. Let me just show you one more time because I know you're gonna have a lot of questions on the image part. Let's just say I want to put my personal image, just my my regular Josh Galvin face image. Let me just show you what I mean. The whole same concept. So I click into my photo here. And I'm going to do the same thing. I click on it. I'm going to right click. I'm going to put copy image URL. And I'm going to see it ends in .jpg so I know this is it. So the whole idea is now when I go to my code box, what I'm going to do here is find the part IMG SRC equals and then the quotation. Right after the quotation until you hit the next quotation. Right there. I'm going to delete that. And now I'm going to paste that new image URL I got, which is just my face. So when I click on Save Changes, let me just show you now how that's going to change the welcome picture. You're going to see my, my mug. See, there I am. So now when I click on this image, it'll automatically start playing the YouTube video. Hey so everyone, this is that's John. how you do that. And if you want to change the YouTube video, of course, remember, all you have to do is change the ID, which is found here, before the question mark. All right? So that's how you do all this. I'm going to have the notes for this, meaning I'm going to give you this entire piece of code like I had it when I first showed you. And then uh, the second item I'm going to give you is the link to the old video tutorial to the previous one that shows you basically how to set up a custom landing page and so forth. All right? So that's everything for this video tutorial. Let me know if you have any questions. Just go to facebook.com forward slash tizish, click on our wall, and just ask, me, ask away there. Let me know how I can help you and so forth. All right? So hit like on this video and enjoy it. Take care.